Welcome back to another video. We sincerely hope that you are having a wonderful day. If you enjoy today's presentation and find it informative, please feel free to subscribe to this channel, like the video, and share the content. Today's video subject, Why do cats have tears in their eyes? Before I get into today's presentation, I just want to say that if you are looking for the medical side of this topic in terms of eye injuries, irritants, allergies, eye discharge, and drainage, please click the initial link in the description box below. You can also find a link within the description of that video that will take you to an article on SeniorCatWellness.com that will hopefully address many of your questions and concerns. Having said that, I've decided to take a different approach to this specific topic. Why do cats have tears in their eyes? I wanted to touch on the emotional aspect and see if one even exists. I've seen on various message boards and just chatter around the web about cats crying and folks asking if cats can cry, if they do cry in the same way that we cry, and if uh, an emotional pull can make a feline shed tears. The answer is no. Cats don't cry tears that are driven by emotion. They're just not wired that way in the most simplistic of terms. A feline's eyes can tear up due to health reasons, but sadness will not stir a feline's emotions in the same way that it can potentially stir ours. However, cats are very emotional animals just in general. Make no mistake about that. And they display emotion and sadness, for example, by expressing themselves vocally and physically. Intense meowing, yowling, and what could even sound like crying, it's all common when a cat becomes very emotionally charged. Sadness, frustration, anger, pain, you name it. Cats can also mope around a bit, almost like children, perhaps hiding out in various spots of the home, just curling up and sort of checking out the feline version of pouting to some degree. But just to reiterate, cats do not cry emotional tears. And while this topic question and the answer is rather simple, this is still a very good question, especially for novice owners. So much of bringing a cat into your home and loving your pet and forming a deep bond comes with a bit of the human touch. In order to keep things light and fun, we often assign things to our pets. In my world, my cats talk and have very deep thoughts about my favorite sports teams. Of course, none of that is real, obviously. It's for my own personal amusement. And that's normal, because I think we probably all do that to some degree. We all talk to our pets and give them thoughts pressing our world upon them simply because it makes things more fun just in general. Assigning a human component to our cats is enjoyable. It helps to complete the relationship. And when it comes to tears, it's easy just to glance over, look over to your cat, see those watery eyes, and think your cat could be crying. However, things like allergies, eye infections, an upper respiratory infection, some type of health concern, is responsible for those watery eyes that you're seeing and the discharge, especially if it's in a prolonged or perpetual state. Here again, if you'd like a bit of the medical side of life, I've placed a link in the description box. It should be the first link that is available. This video was more about just sort of being casual today and asking what could seem like a simple question yet is, is asked quite often. So. Uh, I see this question asked a lot within the community, so I just wanted to chime in with a response, and I hope you found it helpful and informative. Any comments, the floor is now yours. Positive dialogue is a huge part of this community, and I'm thankful to have each and every one of you on board. And once again, feel free to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel if this type of content is of interest to you. Thanks for watching, and we'll talk to you later.